Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays with Sona 5 Royal. Today, well we have a crossword puzzle and maybe TV? No. Okay, let's do the crossword puzzle first. And then... We'll get a massage. Right! We haven't had a massage yet. Sure. Let's do the crossword puzzle. What is it? And a seasonal Skybond event. Oh god, is it fireworks? Let's see. Uh, looks like we have the lettuce for it. And I like fireworks. When I was younger, I didn't have a dog that was afraid of fireworks. Now that I have a dog that's afraid of fireworks, I find them quite annoying. The outdoor spectacle has been popular for centuries. Vessels have, are filled with various chemical pound, compounds to generate color, smoke, and sound upon detonation. Did you know that fireworks don't naturally whistle? That's the result of a special part built into the rocket designed for a nosy ascent. All right. I see. Nice. I mean, yeah. Good stuff. Uh, we need to get kindness, proficiency, and guts up. I'm more concerned about uh, guts and kindness. Hey. Let's get a massage from Kawakami. What? Which I might have mentioned last time, which is kind of weird. We're just calling our girlfriend over to master. give us a massage and then leave. Master. Oh. Like, it's kind of weird. I mean, whatever floats their boat, right? At the same time, kind of weird. Nice. So, let's see. Who is available? Okay, so Mishima and Oya are available. I did mention that... Why not start Oya's confidant, right? Because we haven't yet. Mishima would be a good choice as well. Just to get him leveled up, but... Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and start oh yes just so we ran right by it just so we have it at least rank one get maybe her first ability apparently we, we haven't even been here oh, outside of story hi lala chan the thieves then updated all right hey oh yeah mm -hmm. huh, where's my glass i didn't order a refill didn't i order a refill <clears throat> how much did i drink today what time is it uh who cares wait i care She's so drunk that she hasn't even noticed your hair. If you have her right articles, it'll have an effect on the metaverse. We might be able to use her if we do that. Do it right. Should we try forming a deal with Oya? Yeah. Now then. Keep in mind that she's drunk. Now's now do a good job negotiating, okay? This sounds weird. Hey, Lalachan, are you sure this isn't just water? Well, it's brown. If that is water. Lala Chan, we need to talk. If you're trying to rip me off, I'm gonna reveal all your secrets in a feature article. Oh, it's you! Please, have a seat. Oh, I was planning on it. So, what's up? Got anything new on the Phantom Thieves? Or maybe you're just falling in love with me. Give me like eight ranks. That too. That too? So then you do have news on the Phantom Thieves? Smooth. Thank God. My publisher just assigned me to be the beat reporter for the Phantom Thieves. Man, this will really help me out. Why is your ice cube red? Lala Chan, why is the ice cube red? Are you seriously going to use this child as a source of information? Ah. Oh. Don't be such a killjoy. These kids nowadays know about things we adults don't have access to. Like what? Besides, what's most important is that I now have a reliable third-party source for my stories. Whatever. So, what do you want from me this time? A confidant? Information about someone? Cold hard cash? Uh... I'll let you know later. Nothing really. Nothing really. Huh? <laughs> Lucky me! My very own golden goose just appeared. Now I can take it easy. Maybe I'll take a little vacation with all my free time. 
As if. What do you want? Just tell me. Last time it was info on Kaneshiro, right? Well, he got arrested soon after. So don't think that I can't put two and two together. It's five, right? Something's fishy. Uh... The bad guys are bad! None of the fishy here. I support them. Support the Phantom Thieves? But I see what's going on here. Hardcore Phantom Thieves fanboy. Huh. I mean, I could show you Mishima if you really want to see a fanboy. Hey, I'm not going to let you use this kid so you can take a vacation. Thank you, Lala-chan. A vacation? Oh, <laughs> I was just kidding. I'm conducting a private investigation during my off hours. No one at work knows about it. Don't tell me you're... Hey, how about we do this? You supply me with info on the Phantom Thieves, and I'll write articles based on what you tell me about them. Yeah, that is e exactly the reason I came here. You know, the Phantom Thieves who you love oh so much. Deal? Sounds great. All right then, it's a deal. I feel like we should have had like Mishima come and do I this. I can create a lot of positive PR for the Phantom Thieves, so be sure to give me some good scoops. Oh, I got all the juicy deets. I'm in a deal with Oya. Oh yeah. I can't wait to start voicing Lala Chan again. <laughs> gonna destroy my voice. Your reputation skyrocketed after a certain point. It's unnatural how much your actions were publicized. No, what? No, it wasn't. You see what we were doing? If that wasn't in the news. That'd be fishy. Did you have an inside man in the media? Someone ah, sexist. Manipulate information. Surprising from you, Sai. What do you have to say to that? Yes. It's with the birth of the devil persona. Devil, alright. Probably won't be working on Oya too much right time. now. When we get extra time? Sure. Uh, rumor filled scoop. Decrease the security level when you find a new safe room. Alright. God, that sounds so goddamn useless. Oh, don't tell anyone about this, okay? Well, I am like I want people to know that 15, 16 at a bar at night, so pretty sure my lips are sealed. Okay, Lala Chan, time to celebrate our agreement. Bring out my bottle and two glasses, please. One for each hand. Oh, come on, please. <laughs> Whoa, her silence is golden. And her stare is deadly. Fine, fine, fine. I won't make the high schooler drink tonight. Oh, I gotta use the bathroom. Charming. Ah, oh, she's gonna be in there for a while. You should go home. I was able to pique Oya's interest. I feel like my charm has increased. We get charm for this? For this? You take care now. All right, you be careful on your way home. Don't stick around Sinjuku too long after that, honey. We got a lot of shady types coming out of the woodworks. Hey, Lala Chan. Where'd you go? Lala Chan, come on, where are you? Honestly, this lady's gonna be the death of me. You better head home. If she catches you, you're in for an all nighter. Sounds fun? Sounds like, yeah, sounds like a good time. Be careful now. If you play with fire, you're gonna get burned. Well, I better get inside. Come again. You always be welcome here, but head straight home tonight, okay? All right, so now we're back to being ordinary students who are just trying to make friends and become all powerful. Yes, sounds good. Who are we gonna hang out with first? I don't know. On probably if she's available. She's at rank six, yeah? I have a favor ass. Alright, maybe, maybe, uh, hanging out with, uh, you know, Kasumi here. Senpai, I have a favor ass today. Uh, it's not really, uh, gymnastic things, but would you mind coming with me on a shopping trip? I'm eating now, so no. 
Yo, I didn't bother you while you were enjoying your after meal coffee, but I'm gonna open up shop soon, so get the hell out. Hey, hey! Who's that in the chat? You have a day off today, why don't you go somewhere? Yeah, I know, I'm probably gonna go hang out with freaking Kasumi, I guess. Now there's on and there's Kasumi. Public? I thought that said public execution, and I got really confused for a second. <laughs> like, what do you mean, public execution? Already? Uh, so, yeah, I guess... Like, do we need... Oh, okay, so you're gonna rank up. Hmm, okay, and On needs points. So let's come over here, and we'll get the points for On. No, we can't. We can't do that yet, because we don't have it unlocked. God damn it, I just waited my- like, God! Damn it! I'm on to you! I keep forgetting we don't have that unlocked yet. God, I hope that's coming soon. I want it now, clearly. And in my head, it keeps telling me that... Deepens your bonds. So, two more ranks. God damn it. Two more ranks. Huh, okay. Two more ranks. Assumes at rank three, and she's gonna be at rank four. Allows you to ambush from a distance by attacking with a grappling hook. Sounds kinky. Let's, I guess, answer her text then. Is there anything I need to do other than this? I sold all my stuff. I have a faith persona. I should have all the personas that I plan on. Yeah. All, all the personas I plan on leveling up. So we, we should be good. So let's go ahead and answer her. That is not her. That is the Phantom Thieves chat. Uh, yeah. Sure, let's go see her. And her phone's, her phone's broken again. Thank you! Resend, thank you! Sorry. My phone always seems to be acting up. I think I'm good now. You want to go to a phone st like shop or something? Because, like, holy crap. You need a new phone. I mean, Kichi Joji, you know it. I'll send you the location of the shop. I'll be waiting. Okay. We're go going shopping? Sorry for dragging you out here. I need to get a pair of glasses. I've been wanting to come here for a while, but I never had a chance to drop by. Uh... You're looking to buy? I have enough glasses. You have bad eyes? You, yeah, you, I, I'm assuming one of these. You looking to buy? Yeah, I want to get my dad a present. Okay, not bad eyesight. I mean, it makes sense, right? You seem like a real glasses buff, so I want to get your advice. Could you try on a couple of pairs for me? I'd like to get some visual reference. Thank you so much. Okay. How about these pair? They actually kind of look like mine. The rims are a little bit too thick, though. I think that's good. That is literally Persona 4 glasses, isn't it? Wow, those really work for you. You look so cool. What do you think? Uh, pretty modern look. Not my style. I look sort of aloof in these. That's uh, a pretty modern look, sure. I know, it's so fashionable. It's like you can see through the fog and everything. This could be a good one. Hmm. Um, do they suit your dad, though? Oh, right, maybe a little too hip for my dad. But your input's been really helpful so far. It's been one pair of glasses, Kazumi. Would you mind poking around with me for a bit longer? I mean... Yeah... Sure? I'm counting on you. This is actually kind of fun, I guess. Let's pick up the pace. I see. Oh, yeah, I'm like, wait. Yeah, I couldn't even see the glasses. I don't know. Well, you look like a salesman, do I? But it doesn't feel right somehow. Wow. Oh, I love it. Those definitely leave an impression. I think she's just having fun now. Heck, people might remember the glasses and nothing else about you. Oh. Here comes the man in black. You'll be a star right out of Hollywood. But if my dad wore them, he might look shady. What's your dad look like? I know a certain someone that would love these pair. Why are those even here? I kind of want a pair. Mm. So I can't decide. A lot of them are good, but none of them have really clinched it for me yet. Well, yeah, trust your instincts. 
You know, you're right. I'm the one who has to make the call. I'm just going to going off a gut feeling, but I'll pick this pair. I don't know how to describe it. It just seems perfect for my dad. But then good choice, yeah. Then it's set. Yeah, I think I can be confident in this one. In fact, I know who'll like it. Thank you for bringing me here. I mean, you're yeah. I mean, sure. You asked me to come. I ended up with a great present. All thanks to you, no senpai. Um. Yeah, it's not a problem. <laughs> well, I still gotta make it up to you. Let's go practice in uh, at you know Kashira uh, Kashira Park after this. Sure, I guess. Well, if I'm being honest, trying to pick out glasses was really setting off my anxiety. All I could think about of what would have happened if I couldn't choose, or if I chose wrong. I mean, I already failed in gymnastics, and my cooking turned out bad too. After cracking under pressure so many times, I kind of figured I'd just ruin everything again. Uh, sounds exactly like anxiety, actually. The more I thought about it, the more empty I felt, like I wasn't even me anymore. Um, that's your slump talking, everyone deals with that. That's true. Everyone deals with it. Now! Some people have to deal with it a lot more, and it sucks. But everyone does deal with this. So even know what, uh, even you know how that feels. It's not just me. Senpai. I think I'm starting to understand what my coach was telling me. It's easy to say you're in a slump and write yourself off, but maybe finding out who I really am is also about finding new depths to myself. It does make me feel a little down, but at the same time, I feel like I'm closer to getting my confidence back. And having your support makes me even more determined to make that happen. Well... Yeah, you know what? Yeah, we'll work at it together. He says, <laughs> doing the finger guns. <laughs> this is strange. I don't know if I should be feeling uh, should be feeling like this. I want to get my best performance, but it's like I'll be doing it for you as much as for myself. Or something like that. Oh, she was blushing. I didn't even notice that at first. I'm still working on myself, but I hope we can keep helping each other. So now I can like chain enemies like Scorpion. All right. After the lesson with Kuzumi, Alex can now use the chains hook. Using your grappling hook, you'll will enable you to attack a shadow that is slightly further away than usual and start a preemptive battle. Is this in Karnoshiro's palace? I see them be behind with Kazumi's social link. When you start a battle with your chain hooks, uh, chain hooks, the enemy will begin the fight inflicted with days, confuse, or fear. Really? Now we should get back to training. Maybe we can try some intermediate level exercises today. Sure. You're raising my HP, right? Kind of want All the right. the counselor back so he can raise my SP. I'll be heading home now. All right. Goodbye. So if it's not raining, then fortune teller lady. If it is raining, yeah. Hello, Noah Sabai. Are you able to talk right now? So I already gave my dad the glasses we picked out today, and it suits him even better than I imagined. He was so happy with them. Um, yeah, glad to hear it. Thank you. I think this helped me feel a little more confident. And thanks to you, I feel even more like my gymnastics is going to go better now. I'm sick of wasting my time worrying. Whatever I'm up against, I'm just gonna give it my best shot. But actions always speak louder than words, right? So I'll prove I'm not all talk. Okay, um, I'd better go. I hope we can all talk again. I uh, hope we can talk again later. I mean, yeah, probably. Go to the same goddamn school. Also, we're friends. Kind of weird if we didn't. Ah, uh, you're back. Hi. Inmate. I trust you don't have forgotten about your special assignment. We're waiting in front of our door. We expect you to accept the sass with the Suze. No, I... No. Stop calling! I know I'm popular! Hey, is Futama Chan still asleep? Apparently I'm just calling everyone Chan now. Still asleep? It's been a whole day already. You're way too impatient. Calm down. Uh, we just have to wait. Yes, let us drink some tea and calm our minds. Oh, and some rice crackers with tea would be lovely as well. What? I'm most certainly in the mood. Anyway, we should wait a little longer for Futaba to wake up eh, for something salty today. I understand why you guys feel nervous, but we'll just have to wait for now. Nah, I'm good. We got like 24 days left. 
I'm gonna get so much studenting in, even though I'm on summer vacation. I have a request. No kidding. What was that? Not much longer? There's a movie that won't- Oh, you wanna go to the mo- Oh! No! I mean, some other time. Let me go check the plant. Uh, but it's not raining out, right? I do want to do the twin stuff, but at the same time, kind of got like, kind of got to do the like the fortune teller lady stuff, and then we need another rank after this, yes, to get the affinity one. Like I don't need to max out the the fortune teller lady. Like first, I just want to get that affinity reading shit. <laughs> Let's do a verification test. Yeah, you go away, Morgana. Um, Closing up shop, so please hold on. <sighs> no, son, honestly, I still believe in the existence of fate. I mean, the fortunes I see have an extremely high accuracy rate, but I suppose my divine power isn't completely absolute, huh? Um, you only realize that now. Oh. It's not that, I just need some time to accept the reality. You know, I've wondered... In the wondered in the past whether fate was really can be changed, but I always concluded that it was something beyond our control, almost like the laws of nature, eternal, impossible to defy. And yet, there exist people like you who can ignore those rules and impose their own upon, own will upon the world. Um, How can I become more uh, become one of those people, Noah San? Dodge. Uh, but <laughs> I don't know. Strengthen your will. Trust in yourself. You know what? Trust in yourself. What? Trust in myself? I can't believe you actually bought that. Instead of my fortune telling? I never thought of it that way before. The city keeps finding ways to subvert my expectations. There was nobody like you back in my hometown in the country, Noah san. It was a small traditional town deep in the mountains, populated almost entirely by older people. Sounds awful. I mean, tell me more. During the winter, it practically inaccessible due to all the snow. That alone should tell you the volumes. <laughs> Uh, it just sounds awful. It really just sounds awful. The youth here are, are forced to be strictly obedient to their elders as well. Not explicitly, of course. Oh, and there's a small shrine in the center of the village. There I... It doesn't matter anymore. I left that place to come to the city. It means nothing to me now. After I arrived in Tokyo, I found comfort in this stone. It came from someone who was dared to, uh, dared to care about me, even though I'm just a monster with strange power. You want to see a real monster? Because I can bring you into, like, the metaverse, and I can summon a few. So I sell holy stones. I want to help those who suffer an inescapable fate similar to your own. Whatever. You know it's, just, like, rock candy, right? But now I wonder if they really do much of anything. After all, you managed to change destinies by of one of my clients without one. Is it, is it truly possible to alter fate with nothing more than mere words, attitude, and passion? Can I have $100,000 back, please? If that's the case, I won't be needing this. I'm going to confront he fate head-on and with my own strength. Although the chairman would be e really be mad if he found out. Uh, the chairman? Oh, um... Oh, don't worry about that. Just forget about it. Unless you want to suffer my curse, that is. Anyway, if fate can be changed, maybe even mine can be corrected, right? It didn't work for me before, and perhaps this time... Um... It all depends on you? Right! <laughs> I look forward to our continued exchange, at least until I manage to exchange, uh, change my fate. Oh, and I'll be sure to put some extra effort in my fortune talent for you. So we got, like, next to no points during that, so we're probably gonna have to hang out with her to get, like, the next ring up. Which kind of sucks, to be quite honest, but sure. Until next time. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, I'm calling because I want to thank you again for earlier. Thank you so much for today. To be honest, I'm feeling a bit lost. But that talking to you about everything is helping me feel a little better. Uh, I'm glad to hear it. Tell me more about your home. I didn't do much. I didn't do much. I didn't do much. I just kind of sat there. Oh, nonsense. That couldn't be further from the truth. 
Talking to you helped uh, me realize what I should really be doing. I mean, I gave you some pretty crappy, well, not crappy, but pretty generic advice. That's about it. That's all I'm good for, it's generic advice. Or common sense advice. I can only hope my fortune telling is enough to pay you back somehow. Dude, you get that affinity rank thing going? Reading going? And we'll be good. You know, I can't even imagine changing my own fate, but I will figure out some way to make it happen. I hope I can count on you to help me through the process. Till next time! Oh god. <sighs> Who is it? It's a catchy. Apologies for the sudden message. Are you free tomorrow? A work acquaintance gave me some tickets to the aquarium. If you waste to let them go unused, no? Would you like to come along? Uh Yeah, cuz I don't think we could ever really hang out with the catchy in the original at all, right? For our for like these sort of hangout things. So this is new and something I probably haven't seen before then, yeah? I think. It's almost certainly new. So yeah, I'll commit. And it's a chance for me to get points. Right? Glad to hear it. Then tomorrow it is, I'll send you the directions to Shinagawa Aquarium. So we'll meet there. Guys night at the aquarium, huh? Well, that should be fun. Wait, it's at night? Oh, no, 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 I don't want to do night. I need fortune tell lady at night. Okay. All right. Actually, I could have replied to that later, couldn't I have, huh? Yeah, well. It doesn't really matter. What's what's one day? Why are you always carrying around that the Avengers lovely. briefcase? It's been a while since I've come to a place like this. Sorry for dragging you along. Uh, it's a nice place. Could bring a girl here. You could bring a girl here. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. This suits you, huh? I wasn't sure if you were the type. I like aquariums. <laughs> Familiar voice. Oh. Oh, so yeah. I thought I recognized those glasses. Look who it is! I didn't even get the second de detective prince here, too. For real? Wait, what? Uh. Keep it quiet, please? Oh, sorry! But that's not important. Why are you with the catchy coon? I invited him out. We're fairly close, after all. Are we? You are, uh. Oh, uh, don't mind me. I'm just a reporter. It helps me with my articles sometimes, or he helps me with the articles sometimes. But who would have guessed you were friends with this famous teen detective? And not like you, he's pretty hardline anti phantom thief, right? Mind if I ask a couple of questions for what you do? Oh no. That's kind of personal. What's it worth to you? Uh... Oh. Sure, if you like. Oh. Oh, you're down? Uh, I probably should answer something else. Maybe get points with the catchy. I was just kidding. I'm no model journalist, but I'm not dumb enough to pry into a high school's private life. Yes, you are. I thought this report would be, would be boring, but I got a nice surprise out of it. And I'll see you next time. You have some friends in the media, I see. If I heard right, you, ha you two have some sort of professional agreement? Uh... It's nothing bad. How about these fish? It's nothing bad! Oh, of course. Uh, I wasn't worried about that. Of course, if you have to explicitly deny it, then... No, it's just a joke. I'm sorry I'm prying. Uh, you truly are interesting. Thank you. Thanks for coming out today. We should head home. Is that all I... Is that the only points I... I better level you up, dog. I swear to God, if that doesn't level you up. There's still no response from the Phantom Thieves to Medjet. What do you make of this? Most likely, the Phantom Thieves simply don't have the means of confronting them. WRONG! After all, Medjet is quite different from anyone they've gone up against thus far. It seems their best option is to reveal their identities before more people are needlessly harmed. Nah. You really hit us where it hurts. <laughs> We're going to beat them, though. I'm certain all along. Confacing twilight long, long, long. It's so wet. Oh, it's raining. Shoot, okay. Is that it? Just oh yeah? Oh, 
Well, in that case, let's go to the twins. <laughs> now, I'm not saying Oh Yeah is bad or waste of time. I like Oh Yeah. Her abilities suck. I like her personally, though. Uh, shocking scoop. Security level raises slowly and lowers upon enemy defeating a new. What? Okay, whatever. Seriously, your abilities suck. Chance to fall off by a backup member. If yeah, cool. Love getting increased chances of that. Um, where's the faith one? Because we only have one more left for that, right? He says, right, quote unquote. There's no abilities after this? Okay. Well, we'll see where that leads. <laughs> What's yours? There's a chance of flow succeeding. Dude. How about you make detox happen all the time? Um, sure. Let's come up here and check the plan again. And then we'll go hang out with the twins. Because why not? Nice. Now, I was going to do the, uh... The the, 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 the... the strength confidant, right? That is... The twins one. The twins confidant. I think that's strength. But... But... I'm not going to do that yet. Because I bought all those personas already. And I figured next time we go to Mementos, whenever that is... I'll probably clear out a couple of, uh, slots, what are you gonna do today? and, uh, no. and then we can probably work out the, the, the confidant there, maybe? Listen closely, the place we wish to evaluate your real position is, when one offers up faith and words of devotion. Oh, the church. Every day, lost sheep flock there to pray. There are even cha cases where individuals will confess to crimes. Confessing one's crimes due to a fear of divine punishment. This has a familiar ring to our own inmates of rehabilitation. Does such a location sound familiar to you? Well, if you know where it is, then escort us there immediately. It's the church. What'll you do? Oh, we'll go to the church. Then. So it's called the church? Let's witness the so-called faith that humans offer with their own two eyes. Guide me, inmate. Sure. Follow me. Please don't freak out any of the nuns or priests. Oh. So this is where one prays to the gods in your world. Well, one of them. This peaceful atmosphere here is the antithesis of a prison cell. Huh, is that man standing there one of the gods? He's a priest. <laughs> oh, so a servant of the gods. That explains why I don't sense any expeditional abilities for him. What is that over there? A smaller room? I know! It's an iron maiden for, for reforming criminals, right? Whoever goes inside and fails rehabilitation gets cured. Uh, yeah, that is a confession booth. Confession booth? You mean this tiny box is where the crimes are confessed? Is something the matter? Hey, you! We're here for the confession booth deal you got going on. Oh, you seek to confess at such a young age? All right, which of you would like to go first? What are you saying? Which of us? Do you intend to split us up and pick us off one by one? Huh, no such luck. We're both going in. Um, I see. You're free to do so, but there really isn't much room inside. I can sit on top of one of your shoulders. Are you attempting some sort of decept- Oh, are you attempting some sort of deceptive practice by calling yourself a servant of the gods? You what? Listen to people's concerns? This isn't a form of rehabilitation. Regardless, such talk is cheap. Pays- and But pays quite well. We shall undertake this confession and ascertain the truth for ourselves. Uh, then, uh, as for your confession... Huh, what to confess? It's probably unkind to kick the inmate, but it's part of my duties as warden, so I, that can't be held against me. Inmate... warden? It's none of your business! We're speaking to the gods right now! <laughs> Recently, I've been shifting my uh, more mundane bookkeeping responsibilities onto Caroline. What? You what?! <laughs> I knew my workload was feeling larger for some reason! But she made so uh, she made so many mistakes in her her work that I regret not doing it myself. Excuse me. Of course I'd make mistakes when I've nearly twice the work. How about yourself, Caroline? Don't you have anything you like to confess while we're here? Uh huh. Like uh what? I know you went out and ate uh munchy ketsu all by yourself. Did you really think you could escape my notice? Ah, I was I was curious with the line like. What could humans want so badly that they would want to stay in place for so long? 
<sighs> uh, Medjidolo. Yeah, it's a, the almighty spell. Uh, fine, fine, fine. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Confession time is over. We're done here. Odd as it may be, I actually feel quite refreshed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Were it not for this opportunity, we would have likely kept this, these matters locked away deep in our hearts. Uh, have you righted your wrongs? Do you learn to be kinder to others? What kind of sins are you guilty of? Have you righted your wrongs? That's your job, inmate! Know your place. By the way, why do humans pray to God? Shouldn't they be spending that time trying to solve their problems themselves? Uh, humans have their limitations. It's kind of a support. Sometimes it's all you can do. Hmm. Um. I don't know. I don't know how to answer this one. I think for some people it is kind of a support type deal for them, right? It's something they believe in and it helps them go throughout their day and their life. Um, so for some others, not so much. Um... There are some people that think it's all they can do. And humans do have their limitations. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I actually don't know how to answer this. It's a kind of support. Let's go with that one. Have you given up taking care of your own issues? Perhaps you're the one who needs a change of heart. No matter, we've come to learn how these places of worship work firsthand. We'll consider the assignment complete. Here's your reward. Be given me. Oh, nice. <laughs> Dude, that's a good card. Thank you. You know, confession seemed like they'd be rather useful for your rehabilitation. You gotta confess to us every day. Put that out of your mind, Caroline. Once we return, we're gonna tell you're gonna tell me all about your experience eating you know what. What? What? But I already confessed! Not enough, you haven't. Let us return. <laughs> Take us back now, inmate. I kind of feel bad for Caroline, even though she's always mean to me. Oh, God. <sighs> uh, who could that be at this hour? I don't know. I have a favor to ask. Student Council getting complaints regarding a suspicious character in Ibu K. Respawn later. I distinctly remember a hangout with her that led to us finding, I think, Yusuke, right? No. That was Mishima, I think. There was one hangout where we found Yusuke being a weirdo. <laughs> and, uh, that's kind of how it went. Is on really the only one? Ah, oh, shit. Huh. <laughs> well, maybe I'll hang out with Makoto then. Prove charm. You get a charm we didn't go to the theater? Because if I'm gonna hang out with On, I'd rather do it like playing billiards or darts. Or I'd rather have Fortune Tell Lady give me a boost to affinity and then be able to hang out with her. That's how that works. Um. But you know what? I think we'll decide what to do next time. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, want to hear my videos, I can check out some of the content and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. We all have a great day.